Hey guys, so for today's video, we are gonna do some work hairstyles, so let's go ahead and get started. So first things first, we need to change into a work appropriate outfit, this, this is not it. Okay, so much better. I feel very sophisticated right now, even though I'm wearing sweatpants. We'll just pretend I'm not. I actually recently bought a bunch of stuff from this shop. I'll link it in my description box, but it has a built-in bra in all of their tops. Isn't that the coolest thing ever? So I never have to wear a bra when I wear her stuff and I'm obsessed. I used to work in an office. I used to have to drive 45 minutes one way to work every single day and it sucked and I always just looked a hot mess. What I would recommend is Say hi to the camera. Say hi. 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 Okay, so what I was saying is I used to always look a hot mess and I don't want you guys looking a hot mess. I would recommend doing robe curls or Dutch braids or upside down braid that I showed you guys recently the night before. If you're someone that showers the night before, if you're someone that showers the morning of going to work, that's a separate video. I'm actually gonna do wet hairstyles next week, so stay tuned for that. So for this hairstyle, divide your hair into two equal sections. We're gonna cross one section over the other, and then take the other section, and then pull it through that little hole that we create. And we are just doing a regular basic knot, just like we were tying our shoes. So once you do that knot, tighten it, and then do another knot right on top of that. So do that next knot the same exact way. So now you'll have ends hanging out. So we need to twist those ends around our finger to just kind of twist them like this. We're gonna take one of the ends and just wrap it around the bottom of the bun going up and then hold on to that bun and then twist the other section of hair. Just twist it and then wrap it around. Um, and I did it the same exact way just from the bottom going up and then I tied it with a hair tie. So then I kind of twisted it and then pancaked it, fluffed it out, and this is what it ended up looking like. I didn't use any bobby pins, but you can if you need to, and I love this hairstyle. For the next hairstyle, you wanna take a section right in the middle of your head, tie it off with a hair tie. Now we're gonna tie off a section of hair right underneath the one we just did, so we're gonna have two half up sections. Now instead of pulling your hair all the way through, you're just gonna pull it through a little bit to get a little cute bun like this. Then put your fingers through, and we're gonna pull that top section through that little loop that we just created with our fingers. So it should look something like this. I'm just gonna tighten that and then just start inserting bobby pins. And it kind of looks like a little croissant. It's fun, it's cute, it's different. And this is what we're working with. So definitely try this one. It's neat and I like it. For the next hairstyle, we're just gonna put our hair into a ponytail. And then we are gonna pull that ponytail down, create a hole and then pull our ponytail up through it. So with your hair left hanging out, you're going to divide it into two sections. Just twist those two sections all the way around each other until you reach the bottom of your hair. Then bring it up, put your pointer finger underneath it, and then twist it around your pointer finger going up. And then you're just gonna kind of roll it and fold it in once or twice or however, however many times you need to. And then just put your claw clip over it. Um, I got my claw clips off of Etsy. I'll link them. They are so cute and very like classy looking. I love them. Okay, for the last work hairstyle, we're gonna do a bun. You know I gotta do a bun. So just put your hair into a ponytail and look at my son. He, I have no idea what he's holding, but I didn't even see him until I started editing. <laughs> but then we're just gonna tease our ponytail a little bit, not too much, we don't wanna damage our hair. We're gonna take that ponytail and we're just gonna twist it away from our face. Then we're just gonna bring it up and wrap it around itself. It really is that easy. Take a hair tie, wrap it around that bun, and then if you need to, bobby pin it. I didn't even need to bobby pin it, and this is what it looks like. Very formal, very cute. So that is the video. I hope you guys like these hairstyles. I am like sweating now, so I'm gonna go cool off. Let me know which one was your favorite in the comments below, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.